cure for that which lies within the chest. What is in the chest? We know the heart is within the ribcage. We know that when we say what's in your chest, we mean the purification of your heart in every way that it could be. Number one, Allah's created humankind in such a unique way that sickness is generally told with a simple blood test. The blood runs through the veins and the headquarters of that is the heart. That's the heart. If it is pure and good, the whole body is pure and good in terms of physical purity. One little flutter in the way it pumps and next thing it's your little qiyama because you wonder what's going on. The same would apply spiritually and religiously in your connection with Allah, in your character and conduct, in your thinking, in everything else. If the heart is straight and your heart is clean as we say, when we say my heart is clean, you're not talking of your blood, are you? You're talking of your heart being clean as in you don't hold malice, you don't hold jealousy. Allah says the Quran has in it shifa, shifa for that which is in the, in the chest. The heart to begin with and then everything else. So you want cure of your physical ailments, turn to the Quran. You want cure of your spiritual maladies, turn to the Quran. My brothers, my sisters, we are not doing enough with the Quran. What we are actually doing in terms of recitation or learning its meaning or learning how to improve recital or to understand the rules and regulations therefrom and so on is never enough. It's the word of Allah. It's called Kalamullah, the word of Allah. Imagine Allah, whom you and I are totally dependent on. That's his word. Give it some respect. Read it on a daily basis. He tells you, don't read it for any other reason besides the fact that you will earn my pleasure and it's not going to benefit me when you read, it's benefiting you. What is in it? In it is guidance. In it is shifa. In it is a reminder from the one who made you. Brothers and sisters, when you are diagnosed a sickness, first thing you do, turn to the Quran. We don't do that. But Allah says shifa. We don't do that. Turn to the Quran. Give it importance. Read it. Recite it. Learn it. Check its meaning. Master it. You will be cured automatically. Do you know there are verses of the Quran that have in them cure? Cure and protection. We are taught. Read. Qul a'udhu bi rabbil falak. Qul a'udhu bi rabbil nas. Even the jinn kind will stay away from you. Imagine. If that's how powerful the word of Allah is, that I just read it. I just recited it. Subhanallah. And what happened around me? The whole environment became at peace with me. La ilaha illallah.